Welcome back guys, this is Derek with Project Shanks Gaming. We are diving back into Alpha Polaris. Now, we're gonna go, we're gonna go figure something out. Tolly, uh, when we left off, was saying something, he had found something and that we wanted to see it. Not sure exactly what it is that's going on, but I think there's some good to be found in it. So, let's see here. I'm just gonna move along outside, okay. Where is he supposed to be? Last time he was over by the polar bear. Oh, blood and the polar bear is gone. Fantastic. She's gone. That's a piece of her flesh. So she wanted out and ripped the cage open? I don't see any other way this could have happened. Putting her in the cage was a dumb idea. You've been doing yeah, a totally. science project on climate change or whatever. Is this it? Is this climate change? No. What? Polar bears are unpredictable animals. Especially when hurt and captured. That's like the most you baseless really thing I've ever heard. Here? We are basically animals, right? Maybe the storm messes up everything with a brain. Like you last night. Yeah, just like that. Man, I was far off. I guess it's plausible. The human brain functions on electric signals. I've been checking the magnetometer, and the worst is yet to come. The storm is gaining momentum. I probably need to put the bear down. Can I take the snowmobile? Sure, the keys are in the ignition. I need to chill somewhere for a while. All right. So now I get to hunt. Hunt the bear. Where was the snowmobile? It was over here, right? Yeah. I need to find a way to track the bear first. All right. Let's see what we can find. Uh, tracking device in the lab. Morning. There... Morning. Oh. Made any progress with the thesis? Not really. Well, if it helps, our little side project here, the one involving oil, is showing some real promise. It, is that all you have to say? The bear we caught yesterday escaped by tearing open the cage and apparently hurt herself badly. I'm not surprised. Those are intense animals. What are you going to do with her? I'll probably have to put her down. If the tracking collar is still on, I'll find her. Did you have any nightmares last night? Yes, I had this recurring one when Euler Jr. catches us not doing our jobs. Other than that, just some nighttime flatulence, but that's definitely oh. out of excitement. All these dreams have really gotten That's to him. Lovely. Look, Rune, Ted is not really operating on the level of maturity one would expect. Between you and me, waking dreams mostly occur in juveniles. I understand you've found a large enough reservoir here to start drilling. <sighs> Beats okay. me. Determining the field size will take some seismic work. But we know there's some prime stuff down there. Saturation, volume, color, sweet taste, and whatnot. Substantial Sweet bonuses taste. heading our way if we can focus on the mission at hand. Never! Do you think I can use the radio now? It's still powered down, and I think we should keep it that way. The Tempest what is are raging. You hiding? Even now, in the daytime. That could seriously cripple our equipment. I don't think we'd be able to contact anybody. Unless you want to listen to some dork playing ukulele on Radio Waikiki. One time, a few years back, I remember being unable to hear even the carrier wave from Thule, while still listening to the Moscow Philharmonic. Strange are the ways of upper atmospheric transmissions. I understand you have a long work history in the Arctic. Too long, my friend. Too long. Too long. I've seen all kinds of creatures in here. 
All kinds of jaunty fellows. What are you working on? Tellerix, if that means anything to you. Look, we need nope. to hustle with this thing. Bob's kid is not known for his tactfulness. Bye. Alright. Where's uh where's my girlfriend to be? My love interest. Nova. That's her name. You at your door, baby? I thought I heard you crying last night. Nova. No answer. Okay, maybe she's out in the kitchen. He said radio's off, but I hear it. Oh, there she is! Wearing, like, polar bear skin. Everything all right? Like, clicking your tits, yes, sorry. just had a lousy night. You're not the only one. The radio woke me up. At least you got some sleep. I've been running those samples for, what, like, four hours now? If there's something I can do to help, like, pick off the hairier bug legs. Thanks, but those bugs are still microscopic. How's the bear doing? She's gone. She must have smashed the cage during the night. She's apparently hurt pretty badly, and has an infected jaw. She'll probably die if I don't find her. But you can find her, right? Yes, if the tracking collar is still attached. I still need something to track it. Ugh. You don't look like you slept too well. Rough night? She said no, that. No, it's more like personal stuff. Listen. I haven't had any women strange want. dreams. Not really. Tully had night terrors last night. He seems pretty shaken. I know. First morning in months, he didn't tell any of his sexist jokes. Al thought you might have some insight on those bones and the hide mm. he found. If you mean as an Inuit, not that much. People often have this misconception of our cultural unity, but in reality, there are many different cultures and groups. I'm a Canadian Inupiat. In Greenland, there's the Kala'alit, although the dialect spoken here in the north is Inuktun. It's very close to the Canadian Inuktitut that my mom spoke to me. However, I took some courses on Paleo-Eskimo cultures, so I might be able to tell you something. From my first day here, I noticed how you take pride in your past. I'm sure your mom taught you that. Not really. She always told me to forget the bygone ages and become a trucker. You'd make the world's cutest log truck driver. Surely you've noticed that there are lots of cute girls pretty much everywhere. I would have not clicked that if I had known his line was going to be that bad. You didn't seem very happy to hear Euler Jr. was coming. We just don't need anyone from management meddling in things right now. Especially those who are full of themselves. Yeah. We on for tonight? The date? We are, but I have to zone out for a while first. It's supposed to be a major oil prospect down there? Yes, but Al thinks we need to do a little more work before trumpeting about our find. This conversation's all over the place. Alright. Uh, I, I gotta find some kind of track thing. I don't know, is it in my room? What is the note on my door? Beer can. Bonk. Crampons. Calendar, radiator. Vacuum flask. Triangulation device. Yes! I'm off! Ah, lobby. Okay. I would not consider this room a lobby. I want a gun. Oh. The gun I got is not the same as the one last time. I'm not fucking around. Okay. Uh... Nope, nope. 19.4 tooth infected. A L O 0339. Okay. 
So that's what I'm looking for. What do you mean? I have it! What do you want from me? Dude, I didn't freaking know that. Thank god I can just double click because it takes way too long to transport through this crap otherwise. Alright, let's figure out what my head is now. Giggity. Oh my god. 341. So close to tree fitting. Uh, br 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 br. Laptop of triangulator. Proxy. No, no, no. This. Caller ID ALO 339. Ah, ah, um, ah. Take 15 steps to your current heading. What? Like, just fucking tell me where the stupid ass bear is. 15 steps. Okay, 15 steps. Plot two. Oh, how fucking convenient. I didn't even do what it said. I went in a random direction and it's still like, yeah, there it is. Okay. Whatever. I got the fucking snowmobile. I'll just fast edit that shit out. sneak up on you. You're still dead. I, I don't even care where you shot it. You're dead. Yes? Did you just shoot something? I was examining her tracks. If I hadn't looked up, I'd be dead now. I told you this would happen. Eh. <laughs> Not like a, hey man, are you okay? Or damn. Like, not, not even just, whatever. I told you it happened. Alright. Don't worry, Rune, you'll be fine. Go rub one out. You got a date to prepare for. Gotta get the easy one out of the way. What? Okay. Top proxy track. No. Yeah, spacebar always tells you like what to F and click. Oh my sweet God Almighty! Get me out of here! Get me the fuck out of here! I am close to losing my shit. What about that sample I had cooking up? This thing, you. I see you're making progress with those. Let me know if you find anything. I'm gonna fucking kill you later. I can feel it. <laughs> that was a little forceful. 
Okay. What are we looking at? Cleansed Fionnir, Calcination. Cleansed Humorous. Uh, multi tool. All right. Boom! Look at that. Carved symbol in bone. Two symbols: men dancing and feasting. Yeah, I carve that into my femur all the time. Uh, check the deep cut at the bottom right of the femur. Overall morphology is clearly male. Amazing. The marrow has been extracted. Butchered in a crude manner, marrow has been extracted. Was it eaten? Carries some grave implications. That's one person who might know about these. Hey, Al! I a had to shoot the bear. To pick with you. I was examining her tracks and lifted my head, and there she was, right in front of me. This is so dramatic out of nowhere. What you need to do is up. calm down a bit. Everything is fine. You found the bastard. That's the most important thing. I had a near-death experience, a and no one gives a shit. There are both pictograms and mutilation marks on the bones. Conversations are all over the place. This into an academic study. That may very well be the case, but unless you turn that into potential profit, I don't think the company would be very interested. Otherwise, that sounds very interesting. <laughs> I know. What do you work? Tell her it. We need to. Bob's kid. I understand. Oh, God, I know it. I know it. I know it. Move on. Move on. <laughs> I didn't mean to restart that. God damn it. Oh. Go find Nova. Alright, where's Nova? Let's just look where I found her last. Living room? No? Is it sexist the woman is always found in the kitchen? What the hell is that about? Hello, baby. Is the bear okay? uh, sorry, that's sex. I had the shooter. Oh no, what happened? I screwed up. I followed her and she attacked me. Are you alright? A little shaken. Oh, someone who I'll cares. I found interesting details in the bones Al brought. There are knife marks all over them. And the bone marrow has been exposed in one. That's usually done to feast on the juicy innards. Which would mean Thank you. the Paleo Eskimos were practicing cannibalism. No, I don't think so. Why not? It's known to happen in extreme conditions. Trust me, this is something that I know really well. Cannibalism is a strong cultural taboo for the Inuit. They would not do that. There's some Isn't evidence it for of most? even older cultures than the Inuit in Greenland. Degenerate hunting cults, very warlike and tightly organized, which doesn't apply to us. Sounds like they could have practiced violent rituals. But as I said, they were not Inuits. According to the myth, they were driven into the sea by old Inuit tribes. I have a couple of articles on the subject. I'll fetch you one. I don't want to read. I also have another article about the mythological side. I'll try and find it for you tonight. Your right hand is enormous. I've already talked about your background. We're moving on. Notebook. Open the notebook, then click on the articles tab. Click the page for up close. Oh! Oh God! While well, some scholars believe the Tanager here, some part existed prehistoric men in the Web Islands. This is supported by the Charles Weed, 1962 Wheeled Army. She. Okay. I read. Uh, okay.
Ага. What could the symbol on the left mean? I'll have to think of this more. Sunrise! Sunset! Fuck you! Oh no! Based on her article. Sun rises in the east. This... Okay! Whatever! Uh... East Island Tribe. Kartosh means ownership or signature. This is so dramatic of music. Violent tribe, thousands of years ago, east. All right. Is it time for my date? Oh my God, please tell me it's time for my date. Please tell me it's time for my date. Ah, oh, you want me to talk to Al first? He offers me nothing. I need to borrow the six by six. The carcass has to be moved. Yes, yes, but not today. It's gonna be dark soon. And have you forgotten about a certain young lady awaiting her bomb Alaska? Now? I think I'm too shaken up for that right now. On the contrary, it'll do you good. Get your mind on something else. What sex. is that thing anyway? Get your Ice mind cream on sex. frozen berries? Oh boy. Listen to me, and listen carefully. Bomb Alaska is more than just a dessert. Its roots go back to the French royalty. Making a proper one is no small feat. You need a <sighs> blowtorch to finish it, to say nothing of the perfect timing involved. Luckily, you are looking at an expert on this, as is attested by my perfect figure. I'll scribble down some instructions for you. Uh, and one more thing. You do well if you don't swallow all the things Tully says about Nova. That wannabe womanizer is just a tad jealous. You'll never meet another girl like her, trust me. I've known her for a long time. The symbols on the hide are linked to an old tribe, the Tunajuk. Historians seem to consider them to be a legend. Well, what do you know? There are still hidden things in the world. Okay. What are you working on? Tell us. Uh, we need to hustle. Bob's kid. <laughs> I just don't have it in me. Oh, God, now the notebook. Oh. Exit the lab and go down the to the basement. That's a horror movie cliche. Let's do it! Yeah! Oh, what's in the basement? Lovely. Why am I in the basement? Wait. Powder, maple syrup, sponge cake! That's not even where I was, but okay. Uh, yeah, take that. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I really thought this was going to be more exciting than <laughs> making a cake to wrap up a fucking episode, but all right. Whatever. <laughs> Uh, check the ice cream. What? Brandy, go to Rune's bedroom. Take the recipe. Aha! The booze! Okay. Uh, 
uh, prepare the blah blah blah. Go to the kitchen. Eating food in the shower. Little ninja sex party for your day. Oh my god, you're gonna make me do this, aren't you? You savage motherfuckers. Oh, thank god, wait. Take the sugar from the container on the left. Oh god! Why? Sugar. Oh. Open the fridge and take the household cream. What happens if I don't know how to actually make it? Take the cream, place the cream, sugar, maple syrup in the bowl. Oh, leave the thing open. Maple syrup. Cream. Sugar. Um, use the fire extinguisher? Uh, and get ice cream? Did I... Get, oh. Place the... Oh, no, 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 we're good. Place the sponge cake on... No, stop it. Sponge cake on top. Uh... Use the powder. What? Did I miss a step? Place the sponge cake on top of the ice cream in the bowl. Use the magnet powder on the water tap out. Tap. Uh, get a mixed merge. Place the mixed merge on the sponge cake in the bowl. Let me guess. Continue. What the fuck do you want from me, man? Place the sponge cake on. Use the mayonnaise pan of the water to get this. Place the mayonnaise on top of the sponge cake in the bowl. I'm gonna lose my shit. What do you want from me? Mix merge. Flip it over. Okay. Use the mix manager on the cake. I am gonna fucking lose my shit. Holy fuck. Okay. It, it does look good. I'll give you that. Flip the bowl over by clicking on the plate. Use the manager on the cake. Pour this shit on the cake. Doesn't look any different. Use the lighter. Lighter? Oh god, I don't have- Oh, I do have a lighter. Okay. Kinda cool. Um, click on the cake and select ready. It's ready. Rune automatically sets the table, Nova arrives and they have their dessert. Cake is a, su a success. Wow, it's cozy in here. What do you think? That looks divine. You did good with the flambe. Really? Yes. I haven't seen such a gorgeous serving since Anchorage. Let's taste it. Mmm. Mmm. This is. Mmm. That's disgusting. Sorry. This tastes yummy. So it's a score? Touchdown. 
Well, Did I score? I'd say that Bomb Alaska a la Norway is a glowing success. I think the glowing success was scoring a date in the middle of Greenland. That's not true. Girls grow more desperate out here. So, thank you for it. <laughs> Don't think of it as a gift. I fully expect you to cook something for me, say, next Sunday. Alright. I could make you some Eskimo ice cream. I'm not ah! sure if I want to know what's in it. Yes, you do. We actually call it Akatuk. Wild berries, whipped reindeer fat, and seal oil. In the old days, the fat of chubby Norwegian explorers was also used. Too bad you only have skinny ones around here. Maybe if I gain some weight, you'll consider hanging out with me. Maybe. But before that, I'm kind of curious. Why do you really want to hang out with me? Well, you're my kind of girl. Tell her you want her. As intelligent. I guess you don't date a lot. What is what it? Were they all, what were the Sounds alternatives? Like Say, I want you. Or, uh... You, camera died. with a probe in the back. Unload it. Gee, Mr. Big Shot, I was kind of sleeping here and... Euler Jr.? Yes. Alright, guys. We're gonna have to wrap up this episode here. Uh, if you like this video, don't forget to like, share, Nova, and subscribe. I've are been you Derek right? Project Shanks Gaming. Until Holy next time, been peace. Trying to reach you all day. We're all well. Dad was very worried. I'm in the middle of something here, Alistair. Who are you? Rune Yudsen, a researcher from Norway. I've talked with your father. Nova, show me the lab. Shoot.